this morning that you could cut it with a knife. Yeah. Or that you could cut it with a knife. It's eased off a little bit. But, like, first thing this morning, I don't know whether it was just so hot last night and where it was raining this morning. Um, yeah, it was just so muggy. Um, and I was walking in a shirt, um, like a big baggy shirt, and it just felt like it, it, it wouldn't even matter if I was naked. It felt like I was covered in, like, hot air constantly like you know um, yeah. and not in a comfortable way and i was like oh god yeah so it was like the first morning of brazil like the only time that i felt a little bit oh <laughs> and not long actually either because that's some burn it off yeah i'm connected some waiting, reason waiting for information from server i'm yeah, a minute. Maybe you just you timed out. <laughs> no, it's doing the same thing with me now. Then okay. Um... Waiting information from server. Like I'm in. I'm in the menu waiting for you. Um... Mine says waiting for service. Um, That's what I mean. Like, this is what was happening when I was trying to join you. So let me leave it. Um, oh, why is it? I can join it now. That's odd. Penis. Okay. I don't know what's going on there. What is that appearing? Let me exit the game. I'm going to exit the game again because. Let's um, try again. I don't Technical know whether it's duplicated it or. What was going on there? All right. Multiplayer. Create. Uh, load last safe. I was going to do that Twitch thing as well. Let's load up Ice Window again. Well, Twitch is live, that's all working good. YouTube's live, that's all working good. Great. And now we just need to get the game working. The main bit. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I loaded it up again, so. Cool. What mine's loading? If we go Ice Window, is loading up. I'm just going to quickly update Twitch to make sure it's got the right game on it. Uh, oh, that's already got it saved from last time, luckily. That's good. No changes made. Okay, yeah, I know that. Um, there we go. Let's do that. Done. Cool. Apparently, we had five separate chatters on the last stream. I didn't see them on the analytics. You did five set. Well, one was a bot. Also, I didn't see them. Yeah. Now, apart from a, a D, I didn't see anything and even then after a certain time i didn't see eddie uh, writing anything else i'm in mate good finally yeah i think it must have done something weird we are in am i in yet okay you ready that I click ready. Um, Should you have to start the game? I know that. Okay, I. I'm Please. just giving you all of the permissions. Okay, mate. Thank you. Because I remember you have to do that every time, right? Yeah. 
Hey, okay, let me put it on to follow you. Because I just need to pack this. Um, in fact, recap anyway. We've got to go back um, to Ofgar to start the next bit. But okay, what's every, what to do? Yeah, everything is everything is um, safe. Um, like I selected all the spells and then we rested before we finished. Right. So we have got Hofgar to go and see, but we have got just trying to think. Um, Hopefully that siren doesn't come back. She, she sounded awful. Yeah, she's gone. She's left. Oh, thank God. Um, <laughs> she did we did we go back and tell her that we done it all? We did, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. So she's buggered off now. Um, all these rooms we've done. Um, there's a couple of houses here we didn't go in. Um, and we're not going to attack that guy in the Ian, you know, are we? Because he's just too powerful and everyone hates us. Then. I mean, yeah, like it, it just, it, it's not worth it. No. So we'll go to the temple. We'll get that ring identified. And we'll also, um, yep. Just see if there's anything there that needs clarifying with Mr. Talk a lot. I don't want any more questions. <laughs> don't need heeding, but we appreciate you helping us earlier. Actually, you did help us. Um, and you talk forever. <laughs> Hundred gold to identify the ring. Do you want to do it? At least we can use it. I mean, yeah. It's going mean, to be, it's a, be a ring of protection, isn't it? So, yeah, ring of princes or ring of protection, yeah. Oh, no, it's not. What is it? Both wrong. A ring oh, of resistance. Yeah, yeah, so save versus spells. Um, uh, uh, sure. So. Equipped abilities minus save versus spell plus two. So, do you want it? Okay, I was going to say, um, you're what are you? You're an elf, right? I'm an elf and, and a maid. Gnome, so yeah, so either either of us, it were equal in terms of resistance. Yeah, you might have a little bit more resistance to me, actually. You can uh, always rotate it if we need to. Because mine's a fighter, I'm hoping to get more of a physical protection ring, maybe, or or yeah. a, or a mage ring for extra spells. Yeah, sure. So that's sort of what I'll be looking for if I can get them. I'll put um, my finger in your ring. I mean, put my fingers <laughs> into my. <laughs> and a recap: um, Slim is currently level three. On both of these yes things um which is a uh, cleric cleric and thief thief and i'm level two fighter level two mage so we've done this um she told us everything acadia goodbye acadia i mean do they ever sleep in this town I don't think anyone ever sleeps everyone's on meth <laughs> See if there's anything in here. I don't like sleeping at night time, mister. Oh, what's this here? A little secret box here. Secret box, eh? It's a spear. I like new spears. Do you use spear? No. No. It's worth taking it. It's only a normal spear, isn't it? Yeah. Sell it. Good try, yeah, my person. Ah, <laughs> you fiddle bender. <laughs> I've heard of you. You live in the wrecked airship in Kaldahar, don't you? <laughs> That's uh, you. Uh, about, I think because of the names. Uh, uh, no, no, I don't. Who's fiddle bender? <laughs> <laughs> Who's fiddle bender? Ha. Huh? Well, I heard he was a gnome who took up a shop 
in uh, Kaldahar, the south uh, town south of here. Uh, you sure you, you sure you haven't heard of him? I thought you two uh, might be related. Ah, <laughs> uh, racist. racist. That's racist. We're all I'm, related. A, I, I, I'm a I'm a dark gnome. I'm an under gnome. You know, like the iron iron fist. But yeah. Uh, no, but I'm interested to hear about this wrecked airship. It's like a ship that floats on air. <laughs> no. Uh, laying wrecked right in the middle of Kaldahar. I don't know if Findlebender crashed it there or not, but it must be something else. Sure would like to see it. I'll have to make sure to go uh, to see if I go there. Look. Uh, oh, look. I had some questions about East Haven. Uh, East Haven lived here for quite a span. I have things have been getting worse of late, though. Um, I've so heard some rumors about creatures sighted outside the town. What you heard, I'm worried the goblin and orc sightings are tied to the problems we've been having with the caravans of late. Some of them have been going missing, but mostly only the ones coming from the south. At first, we thought the snow's must be burying them but the goblinoids about it's more likely they're the ones that buried the caravans ah, i must take my leave farewell it well, should be well, my dear uh, they were yeah like it, we already done that didn't we so we already know who did that it was them we killed them we slayed them and we're currently wearing their skins mm. we are slim and podge Slim yeah. and Podge. But together you can call us Mac and Cheese. Mac and Cheese. Oh, I need to put that up. <laughs> <laughs> so I can see. Uh, I am not see I'm only seeing your messages at the moment. So I can't see anyone. Uh, What's that? Did you just do a little bit of B and A? Uh, any, any messages that anyone might say? Oh, right, nothing's come up yet. Right. I just put welcome all just to trigger the chat box on the screen. I see, I see. Uh, is this empty in here? I don't know. You're it's, in there, not it's me. Like, it's like it is, isn't it? That fireplace looks nice. Though. I might take a seat on that chair for a bit. Sort of uh, hilarious. A thief won't go breaking into a house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's lovely and warm. That is... Like, like like here right now? No, I meant the fireplace I was looking at. Warm and, nice warm on the old bum tissues. <laughs> Is there anywhere else we wanted to talk to? I think we did all the missions. Quests, fun quests. Yeah, done all them. Dream Song, Bottle Jed, Missing Caravan, Damien's Fish. Uh, so it's just, it's just now. We'll go to Pomad, we'll sell that spear, and then we'll go to Wafgra, and then we'll tackle the next bit. Sure. Not a door there, is there? Yeah. Slowly rising. Right, Quimby. Uh, I don't know why I'm coming here, mate. See you later. I was about to say, is the one just. Yeah, oh. I don't know why I was resting in. I think it's because I said <laughs> that kid in that guy originally in the end of my head. <laughs> Good thing we're chaotic, neutral. Yeah. <laughs> I don't believe in right or wrong, just for what I feel like in the moment. <laughs> ah, there we go. Pomab. Oh, Pomab's got stairs being gone up yet. Oh. Um, but to buy something, well, really, I want to sell something. Oh, yeah. Give me a moment. Let me just uh, oh, get me one just gold piece off. for that spear. Let me just take off this armor and let me just. Uh, oh, look, look. Oh, I can't. Oh, fouled. Oh, no. Have you sent him red? No, no, oh. no. It's in like fouled to go in shadow. There we ah. go. Ah, oh, it's fancy up here. Do you want to check it for traps? No traps, but 
scrolls and potions. Oh, nice. Do you want to... Right, I've got a gem we could sell. Six gems. I'll put that in the gem bag for now. Come back to that. Cheers, man. The scroll. And I've got a high-quality dagger. Ah, nice. Uh, typical dagger is put... Let's see. Uh... Oh, potion of healing. Nice. Reflected image. We could put that in there. We could even sell that in the future because I've already got that one learned. That might get us some money. Reflected image scroll. Oh, come out, Corb. What's my intelligence? If it's quite high, we've got a good chance of um, not failing the spells. 18. Can you do a quick save, please? Yes. I'm just going to try and learn that spell if I can. Right, magic. Yay! And we've got sleep spell. Yay! Two new spells on the list. <laughs> and we've got sleep and chromatic orb. And I've got, I can do reflect image and magic missile at the moment. Sleep might be handy for a group of goblins and stuff, the little ones. Yeah, yeah but you can't, remember, you can't cast it whilst you're wearing armor. Not at the moment, I can't cast these spells, no. My plan is, eventually, to get enough magic that I won't be wearing the armour anymore. I'll be using yeah, magical armour. you said armor. she would become a battle mage, right? Yeah. Battle mage ranger. Battle mage ranger. So, it's just a shame we can't go any more than two points in a thingy, because I'm an elf. All right. I Right, so I think that's that done. We don't want to go, you don't want a beer out, do you? We've done all that. Been to the fish done shop. That. I think we've got all of the information we can from everyone. So we've just... done all the quests around here. So we'll just go and see what we've got there. We'll go on to the next chapter. Can we still cast we cast those? We cast this chapter one, yeah. Prologue. The class is prologue still. It's a prologue still. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Over here. Over here, Podge. Slim. <laughs> Podge Slim. Excuse me? Slim. <laughs> it's quite noisy for night there, isn't it? Yeah. What Sounds like the middle of the day, but I see. What are you kids doing? What time is it? It's a different time. 5 a.m.? It's, it's a different time, Podge. It's a different time. Oh. It's a shame no one can hear the voices, but he says, Lewa, on his set. We're ready, aren't we? We're ready. We're ready. Let's us be off. Waiting on your, we're waiting on your caravan. As called the har. On they travel across the wind swept tundra of the day, through the foothills of the spine of the world, and upwards on the steep and treacherous trails of the Calderon Pass. Eager to seek out the evil that threatened the pass, they did not expect it to find them first. High upon the cliffs of the pass, a band of frost giants had prepared. Ooh. Well, that failed. So, if it was Lord of the Rings, we took the mountain pass and continued, and everyone but our little band, uh, us, like, basically died. Yes. It's we didn't Hofgar listen to you shall not pass. <laughs> <laughs> Hofgar is gone. Merciful gods! You're lucky to be alive! 
Are you all right? Anything broken? Uh, He's talking to, to yeah. me in one piece. Who are you? I'm just an aging soul who prefers the solitude of these mountains to hustle and bustle of town life. I tell you, I've lived in this past for years and never seen anything like what just happened. You witnessed the avalanche. Yep. Saw the whole thing. I was sleeping in my cave over yonder when I felt the ground begin to shake and I heard a rumble. Something fierce. I stumble outside just to see the avalanche come crashing down. Hey, Christina. Welcome. <laughs> it's a good thing you ran towards instead of back into the past like the others. Poor bastards. One thing's for sure. I'm not dragging their bodies out from under there. They'll have to wait until the snows melt to receive a proper burial. Mm. <laughs> We're touched by your concern for our fallen comrades. Do you, by chance, know the way to Kaldahar? Is this the <laughs> way to Kaldahar? I oh, don't mind him. He's just, he likes singing. He's, I think he's fit. <laughs> Even that, he whacked his head. Are you all right, Podge? <laughs> Why would you want to go to that miserable little burg? Nothing there but a big tree and a bunch of shacks and lean tos. It's an eyesore, if you ask me. Huh? Uh, look, all we asked for was directions. Now, can you open some? <laughs> <laughs> I suppose it wouldn't hurt to point you in the right direction. Follow this trail east through the valley. Hold a hole is just beyond the old mill. Huh? But you do well to keep your guard up. The goblins everywhere between here and the town. Filthy little buggers. Ever since them town folk abandoned them farmsteads, they've been crawling all over the valley like their own place. Huh. Thanks for your help. Farewell. It, it should be able to like just type in lights. Is he not cold? Who, bare me or him? Him, he's barefoot. He's not barefoot, he's wearing boots. Look at the cuffs around the calf. Now, I, it, it's coloured, but he's wearing boots. Right. <laughs> going to say he's hardcore. Other, otherwise, his feet are so frozen, they sound like boots. <laughs> Hello, Christina. Woo! How are you, Christina? Okay. <laughs> his name is Hermit. He's Hermit. He's Hermit the Frog. Well, right, so there's loads of goblins around here, so this might be a. <laughs> it just reminded me of Monty Python, Holy Grail. She's a witch, witch. What? What? what how can what you be that? certain she's a witch? But she turned me into a mute. <laughs> I'm feeling better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can't go in there. Uh, can we not? Why not? There's no in, no button for it. She says that must be his house, isn't it? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, probably. Well, let's take it's this slowly because there could be a, a horde of goblins around here. But yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. If we, could, if we could time, <laughs> it, time it right, though, I reckon my bow and arrow would be good on these. If it's, I thought you were about out. to say something else oh. then. Hey, okay. Here they so, come. Oh, look at that. Straight in his face. Oh. Nice. In your face. Has my guy forgot how to do stuff? He's not firing nothing. There he is. Now he is. It's a tight. Remember, you've got three on you. So you're dodging as well as shooting. So change over to your melee weapon and start attacking them. Because it, 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 it'll take so long otherwise. Really, they need to be attacking you, so then into the mace. Because my guy's rubbish at melee, yeah, which is ironic, yeah. But once <laughs> I get away from him with these arrows, he seems to be pretty there decent. Oh, no, maybe not. I'll shoot this one first. There you go, look, one right. shot, he kills him with an arrow. He just can't hit nothing. <laughs> Come on, with the same height. I will follow. Attack the little guy, then I can shoot you. 
<laughs> there we go. There we nice. go. Well, he jumps around everywhere on my screen again. What we got here then to collect arrows. <laughs> no gold here, no gold. Try uh, try not to to curse too much. The little one is playing on my phone, but you're on sound in the background. Oh, the little one's watching us. So if we get loads of insults, it's not you, it's the little one. <laughs> is that what you're saying? Yeah, uh, excuses, excuses. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, it's too heavy for me. It's too heavy. It's you, too heavy. It's too heavy. You get, you're going to have to take it. I'll say take you picked it up. I might take my axe off. And not do two weapon fighting. It might benefit me not doing two weapon fighting. So I'm not trained in it. Yeah, unless you have a mace. Um, There's one up here. There's a few up here. I remember that ooh, goblins. But I could, I could use. I'm not trained in it. Um, what does that take me down to? Oh, dexterity minus four. I suffer by dexterity. Ooh. Yeah, no, 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 I'm not going to do that. Um, my, yep, my dexterity is minus four at the moment. Why is that? Probably because you've got a two weapon fight. You're you're holding on to two things. I've just took I've just took it off now. So I've only got maybe it's the wrong weapon. Let me change to that one. Minus four still. I've got a plus one though. In um. Yeah, I don't know. I thought plus one takes away all the negatives. I'm minus four. I've got Flower, Morning Star, and an axe as plus one. Oh, uh, it's Morning the armor. Star. Ah, right. Armor. I just saw. Heavy. Yeah, split now. Armor class four, dexterity minus four. I would say that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, under under uh, record, like split now on the left side. Split now, armor class. Oh, oh, it's the armor class yeah, causing this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Which makes sense, yeah. Yeah. Because it's heavy armour. We're not trained in heavy armour. So have you just chucked like, everything at me? Yeah. <laughs> got no space in there. It's like open up your... Pardon the pun. Open up your sack and just throw everything in. When you I could do... Armor. I'm not trained in shield, but I could add a shield. It puts me minus one armour. I've put a shield on because it's, yeah. it's a little bit of armour. Yeah. I might do that for now. I don't need all these axes. Because we're so low that. level, we haven't. Well, I haven't really got the skill for uh, fighting. No, well, I've got. So. Oh, chicken! Who you call chicken? We will also moderate our language for you, Christina. If little ones watching us, we will not do any certain words. Oh, then again, you know, with Go our on. accents. It, it, even if the little one could understand English perfectly, like yeah, that's true, it, you know. But if she only mimics sound, she might hear her just rather just go, Oh, yeah, she might just, yeah, 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 yeah. Go, Mama, <laughs> effing wow, <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Where'd you get that from? First word, oh no, <laughs> dwarven scum, oh, she just said. Where did she learn that? Dwarven <laughs> scum. What's she got against dwarves? Well, they're goblins, aren't they? So yeah, goblin, goblin scum. <laughs> goblin. Oh, more oh, right. oh, oh, hold on. They're hold coming on. through this gate here, so I'm going to stay yeah. where I am and just fire my arrows. Goblin oh, who's this? Who's this one here? Goblin marshal. Oh, they've all teleported again. We're not ready. Smashy. Smashy, smashy. My game's doing that freeze thing again, so no one's moving. Oh, we killed him. Mm -hmm. Nice. Well you, well, you did. Huh? You did. Oh, no, I did. I you did, did yeah. <laughs> yeah, you never one bites the dust. One more. And there's one oh. to the south. One that shot me. That one. Oh, it's all, it's all jumps again. You knobhead. 
Mummy, no bed. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, what's a knob? <laughs> oh, it's it's like it's what you use to turn like volume up and down. It's that this is a knob. Oh, ah. what, what's a knob head? <laughs> <laughs> it's when you put it on top of your head. <laughs> English oh. people are so strange. <laughs> oh. oh. I just picked up a potion oh. of... Oh, shit. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm, I'm shooting. I'm shooting. I'm shooting. I'm dying. I'm dying. You, 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 it's it's going gonna, it's, it's gonna to be no move play. My guy's not moving. Oh. Uh, excuses. Excuses. <laughs> now he's moving. Killed that one who was shooting you. I will kill you all. <laughs> <laughs> I got some weird buffering going on there. Oh, uh, well, you, you haven't like proper rubber band in there. Eh? Yeah, like the guy's there next to me. I click on him, and then he's like tw two foot away from me. All right. Uh, that's what we cleared out their camp. Latency issues. Well, oh, wait. Yeah. Well, there's loads around here, Lee. Kill. I took him out. Let's shoot him. Well, he's gone. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so slow. Oh out. no, I'm dying. I've took three out. Save me. My guy's just been really slow. Save me. <laughs> Save me, you bastard. Yes, die. I've got three on me now. Well, oh, you've not been good. <laughs> One's dead. Christina said she's got her phone back now and she <laughs> does mimic words. <sighs> Mummy, what's a goblin? <laughs> What's it's a bum a hole, mummy? <laughs> <laughs> nah. I mean, uh, That'd be funny yeah. if, if she started going to you. Nah, mum. Nah. Nah. Nah, nah. mum. <laughs> you don't know nah. me, mum. You don't know <laughs> me. <laughs> you, know, you know nothing, mum. You know nothing. Get out of here. <laughs> uh, right. <laughs> there is. Have a quick look at the map. There's a there's a <laughs> She's laughing because you're laughing. <laughs> oh, that's cute. We are pod and slim. <laughs> Double act. You can hire us anytime. <laughs> but it's satire because he's he's podging I'm slim. <laughs> oh. And it's also satire because I'm a fighter that can't fight. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a thief that won't still. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, we can't get anything here. Wow, you are balancing everywhere, aren't you? <laughs> She's learning from you already. <laughs> her mum has trained her well. <laughs> Just like her mum. <laughs> Mock Donnie and Lee. Do a quick save, bud. There is a baddie in here. I can't remember if he's got any ones that fight with him, though. But I think we have to help him. Can't remember now. Well, he's not a baddie, then, if we have to help him. He should be a baddie. Ah. Greg. 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 It's Greg. It's Greg. Head hurt. Why you make Greg's head hurt? Skinny people. Skinny people. <laughs> naughty boys and naughty toys playing in with their naughty toys. Uh, what should we say? Um, <laughs> sorry, I'm just trying to get me... Um... 
Kip, what you say next. <laughs> head hurt? Why you, mate? What's wrong with your head? That's what I would say, because I'm a... I don't know what I am. Oh, what's his no, head? No, no. Walk here from my cave. Need to answer call. Now cannot. And the head. It hurts. Greg wants to pound head against wall to make head okay. <laughs> he's, he's not happy, is he? No. You can't pound your head against the wall to make it feel better, you stupid oaf. Or well, that's kind of friendly, but also a bit. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, sarcasm. I think that's an excellent idea, Greg. Hitting your head against the wall as hard as you can. It will certainly make the pain go away. It's an old. Reg Hedeman Barbarian Remedy. Try it. You'll see. Ha ha. No funny. The Reg Head hurt. Oh you no. Help me. Now go and make your head hurt. That's He's gonna kill funny. Us. <laughs> I'm going to run out of here because I've only... Oh, run away. Oh, God. Why? Yes. Once he pulls it, you keep running and I'll keep arrowing. Okay. Don't run to the right though, because there's goblins. So sort of go down and left again. Yeah. Right. And I'll try and get in. Don't kill me. No, you've gone the wrong way. You've gone towards me. Well, you said don't go to the right, and the only I other way left is left. Right. I meant go down then left, not left. I can't really? go down. That down is left. Oh no. It's all right. Sorry. Right. I'll, I'll, I'll beat him. See, I'll, give him, little, I'll give him a little bash. Wait. <laughs> there we go. Oh, he's after me. He's after me. He's trying to kill me. This is what I bad him, man. Cool. He's trying. He's trying to Got kill him. me. Oh. He's trying to kill me. <laughs> Pudge, ow! I've then he got him. One more hit, I think. This froze, mate. Yeah, yeah. Take yes. that there. Yeah, you see, I, I am, I am the ogre slayer. I think we missed that now because we killed him. We meant to save him, I think, and get the um, experience points. What's in here, though? What are you talking about? He, he he had a hangover and we cured him. No, oh, nothing in here. Are no sure way did that... he no way did he sleep on that bed. I think I think he woke. He tried to and he broke it. <laughs> Do you want to try and rest in here? Get some health back. Uh... We can. I bet we can. Oh, see if we're gonna work. Go. Oh, there's gonna be loads of ogres up here looking for Greg. It's all good. I know nothing. <laughs> Yay! Right. Let me just quickly check my um. You know nothing, eh? What? That's a short bow. You know nothing, John Snow. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Uh, I'm class A act of impressions, I am. <laughs> let's, let's not go up there yet, because if we go through there, there's hundreds of them in the next screen there. I know that. So it's a goblin camp. We should uh, definitely go there then. Oh, we'll be killed instantly. No, we won't. Especially why I'm rubber banding. I can't even fixate on one thing. <laughs> yeah. One second, let me just look at my um one sec, let me just pause that. Just let me look at my um thingy, what do you call it? Do you think? My, C my CPU mm. is saying fifty eight percent, so that's not a lot a lot. Mm. And my RAM seems to be stable and normal. CPU's bouncing up and down. I wonder what it is. Let me close this extra tab on my Chrome. That was me just looking at the YouTube live. But I didn't have to open yesterday YouTube tab, so that so it happened yesterday as well. And do I need can I have the game open but close down Steam the, the app? Yeah. Maybe... Uh, you can't you can't close it down, no. Oh okay. Um I'll do that for now then. Well, I've chosen, I've tried that. 
It's mainly in combat it happens, isn't it? When it's running multiple things. I think it's just uh, the same thing as everything else, dude. I think it's your data technology with your with your backwards line. <laughs> What's up here? There's more goblins up there. You got inside a house, and there's I think there's some yetis around here somewhere as well, if I remember right. I I, I thought we would have seen Bart Simpson by now. Bart Simpson? Yeah, he's always around the mill house. Da -da oh. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, that was. Oh, hold on. You can talk to this goblin marshal. So, is this the baddie that you have to save? No, it was the one inside the um, castle. You save him with a headache. You give him a formula, like a medicine. This guy oh. gets angry. But if you go in that building, there's quite a few baddies in there. They're quite tricky. We, we, we cured him. We cured him. Oh, we've cured his headache, definitely. Permanently, some would say. Yeah, yeah, that room you're going into is quite tricky. Oh no, I'm waiting. I didn't oh. know whether um, we're going oh. somewhere else or. I was just opening up the bottom of the map just so I can see. Yeah, that, yeah, I, um, I was watching. <laughs> uh, right. Well, we can't use bow and arrows in there. I know that it's all really close proximity. Should I take my armor off and do some spell casting? Yeah. Sure, because I could do my spell casting with a rod. <gasps> Dana, which is uh, Jesus, Christina. Ah, you, <laughs> brought, you just brought me and Lee a pint in the future, each <laughs> in Copenhagen. Ah, thank you. Yeah, or a, or a bus ride to. Um, I'm not even going to attempt <laughs> to the to, nearest shop. Yeah. yeah, in English, in England, like any any towns, let alone you know, yours not that old wood live uh, anyway. Ah, uh, what could we do for you, Christina? As a thank you, should we do like, um. A mercy, a mercy kidding in your name. <laughs> yeah, by the sacrifice. Yeah. I'm going to cast my reflect. Do image. that. No, you do that. You, uh, you just wasted that unless we're going straight into combat. Going straight in. Okay, that's what she said. That's what she... Where's my dog on? Follow me, bud. Yeah. Dance, puppets, dance. Lee's got a great dance, he'll show you. I've got many dances. But most of them are for mating rituals. Oh, oh, oh. I mean... I think, was, it, did it, was it good? I, I mean... I mean... It works. It's different. <laughs> <laughs> um. I call that one the Chris Tonga. It's like the Conga, <laughs> but Christina. I was, uh, yeah. I mean, I would say it's amazing, but that that's just playing <laughs> off. That's just playing off a labyrinth fun because of dance puppet dance. Oh, the I actually love the labyrinth. Yeah, dance puppet, dance, dance. Oh, I oh, sorry, I paused it. Are you ready for combat? I don't think I'm gonna attack it straight away, or I'm, I'm, and, I'm, it's... I'm never ready. I mean, I'm always ready. I was born, I was born ready. I was born with a cleaver in my hand, which is why it wasn't a good birth. <laughs> Christina, what we could do? Because at the moment, I've got no um. Now that thing that came on the walking zombie, maybe we should make some D and D versions oh. of them. 
Maybe we can make a, a Christina version of a thingy. Maybe of a sword. It no, no. It would have to be like uh, a, a finger pointing sort of one. That it sort Viking. of look, looks like you're judging us because you always seem to be judging us. <laughs> Viking style as well, I think. Viking style, why? Because the Danish. Yeah, and the bacon. Because <laughs> maybe like some steak flesh. Having a little baby pig under one arm and a finger. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Munching <laughs> on some steak flesk. Because <laughs> Christina, steak, Christina, what's was that? What, munching on what, Don? Steak what flesk. It? Steak <laughs> flesk. Steak flesk. Yeah. What's steak flesk? It's like crispy bacon, I think, or pork belly bacon. <laughs> Because of Christina's OG, like the original OG, G, <laughs> like, the original G, <laughs> for for doing supporting in that, we should make an OG. I don't know what you call. What are they called? Alert. How things. do you remember how to say it? What do you mean? How do we do listen? <laughs> and I mean, if, I think if if pronouncing the... it as close as what you what we remember you saying uh, as well as we would pronounce which is butchering your language which I apologize <laughs> i think it's one of the first things you ever said in one of the live streams you were talking about food and you mentioned what you was making that day and that's always stuck in my head because it sounded really tasty and i really like crispy meats crispy meats eh mm. All right, so let me just lay out in the sun for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> that is nice prime jerky there. <laughs> All right, give me half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> Practically mummified. <laughs> uh, Oligar. Oh, uh, oh, no. I am Oligar, chief of the bleeding eye. Bow before me and pay tribute. It's talking uh, to you. Are, you. are you saying that you've got hemorrhoids? Um, if you've got a bleeding eye, that doesn't sound good. Um, uh, uh, are you serious? Do not mock Chief of Bleeding Eye. You'll give tribute now or die. Oh, okay. Uh... This is just a tree of you. You gotta <laughs> believe it. Okay. I wish um, you were here. Just <laughs> a matter of opinion. Good <laughs> God! Good God! You gotta love it. Get something right. now! Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, how about you shut? No. Okay, okay. <laughs> Give a tribute or die, eh? Uh, it's getting pretty late. I should be probably going and see you later. <laughs> <laughs> um, everything else is insulting. I think either way, we're going to have to fight, aren't we? Yeah. So let, let's be let's let's be cheeky. Ah, oh. oh, oh, ah! they, like, they didn't like cheek. They didn't like cheek. Oh no! Don't die. Got hit me hard. Yeah. Oh, my guy, for a fighter, thank you for the healing. My guy's useless as a fighter. <laughs> Frontline fighter, and he can't hear anything. It's not exactly like it's a small thing. I'm going to hit that guy, though. So I think it. he's got a bow and arrow, this one. Yeah, he's got... Yes. <laughs> he's at a disadvantage now. The orcs Come on. in this seem a lot more beefy. Yeah, they're solid, the didn't they? Games. Yeah. Oh, Come nice. on, Smushy. Have you even hit your guy yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't even eat his shins. <laughs> oh. Hey, I got one. Yay. <laughs> I've killed that one. On the roll there. Well, actually, let me just get my bow and arrow out and go over here and shoot him. There you go. <laughs> Yay. Hey. Makes such a difference, a bow and arrow. Oh, what's magical that? Magical flute. Flute, flute, 
fibbly suit. Let's well, get that a, a flute that needs identifying. Uh, which you'll probably have more. You'll probably have more law than me. Identify now. Do you wish to identify the only with uh, identify a scroll? <laughs> it's either a scroll or a spell. What's and your law? Usable by a bard, which I am not. That's annoying. Isn't it? But there you go. You you can keep that. That's for you. We might be able to sell it then if we can't use it. Probably. Might be worth a bit of money. What's your law? I can't even find mine on here now. I am the law. <laughs> um, or breaking the law. Um, where would I see? I'm thinking. I can't remember. If it's still ah, there. sixteen. Oh, better than mine. Mine zero. <laughs> <laughs> so we, literally, when we said I know nothing, that is correct. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I literally know nothing. Yeah, you know nothing, and I know something. That's quite a cool <laughs> weapon. I've not seen that before. So, we'll, what's that? That little flute thing. I think we can sell that. Mm. Got some few things to sell here. I mean, I've got too many axes. They're only worth one gold piece. Um, yeah, from but, from. But the, well, I'll keep one because I actually use axes. But we might be able to sell the short bow and the other thing. Um, we've got, there's more stuff downstairs. There's another battle downstairs as well. But, so these people used to live here, Lee. They used to live here? Well, they're dead. Well, they're, they're still living here. They're just not really using it to the fullest that they could. <laughs> Don't you need to be alive to live in there? Well, that, that's what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> where did uh, you go downstairs downstairs a little bit of assistance please ah oh, what are you doing these are our guests you should treat them with like the utmost respect I have done I've not hit them once yet <laughs> <I'd have hit laughs> oh okay spiritual armor give me a spiritual armor there we go go on give me a smack oh yes Oh, it makes oh, no I sense. I, I pulled a bow and arrow out. One shot kills that guy. Oh, that—that's what it wasn't me. It was you. <laughs> God damn it! I get spilled forever. Nice. Oh no. Um. Wait, I've got a potion here. I can drink. Sure, sure, sure. There we go. Thank you. Cool. By the time I get near him, oh. he makes some noise, doesn't he? I'm, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's sounding a bit dirty. <laughs> yeah, oh, there's two of us on him now. We've got to be able to get him, Dan. Two of us. One in front, one behind. What? <laughs> Whoa, that works. Yeah. That is some uh, meaty, I mean, meaty sometimes, bits there. Sometimes the words, the not just it's not not necessarily the words; it's the order in which you use them <laughs> makes it sound so wrong. <laughs> it's brilliant. Oh, can... oh wait, wait! There's another. Is that up or down? It's a What's that? I've got a throwing axe there now. Ah. Uh, I can grab those gems because they go in my gem bag. Ah, ah, oh my god. Oh my god, let me go down. Oh my god. Oh, there's another room where you have to fight more. They will surround you. <laughs> god damn it. Yeah, cheers. I did ask. You didn't answer. I, went I was, up. I I was sorting out the inventory. Someone's That's chucked loads of shields no in there. Good. No good. <laughs> <laughs> I just randomly, I couldn't pick nothing up. And I looked and there was loads of shields. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> I'm not going to use that. I'll play in your pocket. <laughs> there we oh, go. brilliant. There's, there's a, oh, there's more shields. More. <laughs> God, if, if you want to be a, an axe and a shield collector, come to this room. <laughs> uh, I can't. I can't. I, I get over encumbered too quickly. I'm a gnome. 
creepy. I mean, it's true, and it's a good excuse. Jersey. Oh. Shh. Be quiet. All the goblins will hear us. What are you doing in the closet? I'm hiding from the goblins. They they got my dad and sister. Oh no. Tough luck, kid. Life's... Nah, I'm not that cold. I'm <laughs> neutral, but I'm not cold. I'm sorry. I know it can be. It can't be that comforting for me to just say it, but slip my finger. It will be okay. <laughs> Let me take you to the village. I'll help you. <laughs> I'll find help for you what there. What does that smell like to you? <laughs> does it smell like orc bum? Does it smell like fish or cheese? <laughs> 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 oh no, that's not a good sign. Fish Ooh. or cheese? Fish or cheese? Ooh. He's now run off to um colder heart. Who's leveled up then? Me? Oh, fire apart. Well, you've so got, can... you got to say it like the narrator. Colder heart. Colder. Now, what should I put my fighting point into? My weapon. I've got two in bow already. That's maximum. I can't do no more. Um, what are you I'm, using right now? The one this is working better than my axes. I've got a flower morning star at the moment. I'm using that. Do that. Uh, double that up. Does that make sense? Um, I'm not too sure if I should do what weapon in, and then put a point into something else afterwards. Yeah, like two weapon style or weapon and shield. Or I'm doing weapon and shield at the moment, so I might stick with that. Um, I won't be living up for ages now. Eight thousand is the next one. Then 800 for the mage, yeah. so quite a while. Yeah, you're halfway. I'm halfway there. At least my hit points have gone up now, though. 22. Um, yeah, thanks to me. Thanks to me. You're welcome. You're welcome. Can I take yeah. armor off and put it on during combat? No, during combat, no, right? Because I've got that magic missile to use. That's what I mean. You have to think beforehand, yeah, right? If you're gonna be fighting or doing magic and you should be basing that on who you're facing right you if like if you know they're going to be vulnerable to magic then go for magic and i'll go in and sacrifice because like i'm going to be fighting um i'm always going to have armor on um in a fighting situation, I'm only going to take it off when I'm doing thieving. Yeah. Yeah. Because I, I don't know if, like, wearing armor takes away your backstab and stuff. Like, no, oh, you. I think you will lose your backstab, won't you? You lose something with armor. Cause maybe, maybe because that's like the dexterity thing. Hmm. Yeah. But it's something like that's more of like an as and when needed, really. Yeah. Um, because the Kirk thing sort of overrides it in terms of fighting. Could have cleared this room, Matt. Yeah. 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 There's no nothing, no other way to get up in that. No. So back out that way. Back out this way. And then back out. Rest in peace, people. We can't we can't carry you. I've got no room anywhere. You can't, can't set the place to light either. I've got too many shields in my bag. <laughs> <laughs> Did you speak to him in the end? To who? Him? Yeah. No. I'm out doing here. Uh, you can speak common? Of course. No goblins are idiots. Just most of us. Ah! <laughs> Why is the buzzing in my head? Uh, what's wrong with you? I, uh, don't know. Something's in my head. It's whispering things to me. But I can't understand it. But something inside me. Something inside me does. I have to answer it. Ah! Ah. Uh. That's unfortunate. I have to be going now. Very well. Oh, I'm mad with pain. He told us and he said uh, that something was whispering to him. Ah, okay. 
He felt oh, some shit. instinctive urge to answer the voice in his head. Okay. The voice cool. in his head. So I'm just quickly looking for that music you sent me. Because I just realised, because no one could hear anything on the game, even the, the game music. I'm going to chuck your music in the background. Ah, that's a good idea. Um, or any music. For... Where did I save it under again? I can't remember if I, I made a folder with your name somewhere. Um... Probably several insulting slur, slur, slur names. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, I found it. Twatty twatty my ball bag. There we go. There <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you cared so much. I do. You got two ball bags at all, I did. <laughs> I mean, you called me twenty twice. That means a lot. It does. <laughs> That's pure affection. That is <laughs> pure love. So <laughs> I go to say is like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Are you sure? Is he a special friend? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Uh, fucking in between this reference. I was there, sorry. Now don't, now don't laugh, right? I was looking around for where I put my can. One second, let me just do this in style mode. <laughs> Where are you on my screen here? I'm right next to you. Hey. Wait. There we go. Show us again. I was just saying, I was just looking around. Oh, wait, but you can. It was in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we can't go to East Haven because it is no more. Well, the, the, past the is racist. Anyway. We don't want to go back there. And we've got Kaldahar next on our list. Ooh. I mean, we've done everything at East Haven anyway. We don't need to go back. No, but she did have nice brandy. The drink? Nestled within the roots of a massive oak tree, tiny cottages were a welcome sight for the weary travelers. As the party approached the town, a warm breeze blew, chasing away the chill of the frozen nights, and carrying with it the sweet scent of the cooking fires. I tell you what, my, I, not, not, I, I'm not blowing my own trumpet, but. Just to hear my music sort of slowly fading in the background after you finished talking. <laughs> it fits. Like, I, I... It fits the games, doesn't it, in the world? Yeah, yeah. That's not too bad. So if anyone, anyone here watching, which they're not, if you do see this in a future video, because the YouTube saves it, and Twitch now saves my streams, thankfully, automatically, um... It just doesn't save music streams because the licensing, but game streams it will keep. Um, music was made by Slim. By Slim? Yeah. That is you. Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, it's daytime now at least. 11 o'clock. Visited Goldahar. We're in Kaldahar. We're not visiting it. We're visiting. <laughs> Be nice to rest. Excellent. One second. Before we do anything, should I... Oh. Should I change my spell? Level one. Any of them. I would say do whatever you wanted to. Whatever you felt would be the most diverse because really when you take your armor off mm. you're vulnerable in that yeah. sense so you want something that's diverse you definitely want mirror image because it essentially it makes it harder to hit you um 
I was Magic thinking maybe sleep doesn't miss as well. That's true, yeah. And sleep, it, people can have a save to it. Mm. Whereas Magic Missile always hits, for example. It will do damage. I'll leave it where it is then for now. Yeah, I'll leave it where it is for now. Although someone might be invincible to the Magic Missile, but Chromatic Orb is a specific uh, damage, right? So I think it has some effects, didn't it? it as well, later on. I think, yeah. I think. I knew you'd make it through. I just knew it. Who are you? All right, Nate. Oh, he actually does say that. Who are you? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Like, who are you? How did you know we were coming? I'm Nate. Wait. Oh, we mate. Aaron Donald said that was help was on his way. I've been out here every day keeping a lookout for you. Where is the rest of your army? Are you just just scouts or something? Sorry to, to disappoint you, but we are alone. We are Slim and Podge. Mac and cheese. Waffle <laughs> and coffee. Flip and flop. You may have heard of us before. No, never. <laughs> Everybody has heard of us. I haven't. <laughs> have you been living under a tree or something? Yes, that's a big thing here. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is all oh, well. That's a big tree. Yes. <laughs> so... <laughs> Hello. I thought for sure that the ten towns would send an army to help us. Wait till Arendelle finds out it's just you. It's not just me. It's <laughs> Slim and Podge. <laughs> Mac and cheese. Lip and flop. Coffee Waffle and, and waffle. <laughs> Do we need to repeat ourselves again? Are you saying coffee and waffle because I'm black? <laughs> <laughs> Arendelle's my friend. He's the oldest and smartest man in the whole world. He can talk. I have a law of zero. He can talk to animals, you know. You should probably go see him. He'll be wanting to talk to you too. <laughs> no, <you will. laughs> Where can we find this Arendelle? He lives across the bridge on the other side of the brook. Just look over the house with the, the three big rocks out front. Thanks, Nate. Farewell. And remember. You've just spoken to flip and flop, waffle and coffee, <laughs> mac and cheese, and something else I've forgotten. Yeah, it's your names. <laughs> Hodge and Slim, Avril names. <laughs> oh, well, does not every house have like at least three rocks outside? <laughs> Ooh, let's see. Oh. Oh god, my eyes! <laughs> Curse, Why are you always shot. half oh. dead? Because it's normally me fighting four at once, and I can't hit nothing. No, until I get don't, don't arrow at. give me that. Don't give me that. I've been taking on the world, and you've been out there flinging your 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 your, your friggin' points. I am a ranger. I do well when I'm at. No, you're reason. not. You're you're not a ranger. You're a. Uh... Uh, a single laner. <laughs> you have no range. <laughs> Let's see if it all. Girth. 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 <laughs> confident name, isn't it? Wait, wait. That must be really his wife comes from Girthy. Why'd you do it with that sound? Because I'm girth. <laughs> Where so the wind blows, travellers seek shelter and supplies, mayhap. Good day and cheers to you. Sir, my name is Girth. I tell by the cut of your cloth and your bearing that you are a visitor fresh to Kaldahar. Is there something you wish to purchase? And remember, my name is Girth. <laughs> Perhaps... May I see what is for sale? I'll ask what this place is. It's a shop, obviously. <sighs> this is my shop, friend. I supply caravans in the shade of the Greek oak. 
this shop was my father's and my father's before him and his father and his father and his father and his father's father's fathers and his mother's father's fathers and his father's friends daughter's cousin's uncle's friend ah so you know of him yes 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 i do <laughs> you must have a law you must have a good law at least i have 15. a law of 16. oh yes i thought so you sir must have a law of zero going by your expression <laughs> i know of at least two towns over <laughs> law of zero is soon to be one so don't be too confident <laughs> If you believe, um, like many of the places in Coldahar and the surrounding lands, there is much history to be found if one digs deep enough. Wait, are wait, you... wait, is that is that is that a slight at me because I'm a deep no? Are you are you <laughs> trying to are you are you trying to are you trying to be funny? <laughs> I don't know if he's funny. It doesn't look like he's funny. Well, then he didn't that, laugh yeah, didn't... so far as to say that. <laughs> <laughs> I dabble in time's passage. Is that your wife's name? <laughs> like, is, is she Miss Tyne and wait, you are Gurf? Wait, is, is it, you are that Gurfy that is now a passage. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps that is not a full time occupation. I hope not. <laughs> Merely a hobby. What's he talking about now? Because my know. mind's gone off. I, I don't do, know. I do enjoy learning more of the past and examining trinkets from around the area. I have huh? quite a collection. A little museum of sorts. Some call it junk, but... What so sort of you, things? So huh? you got junk. <laughs> yeah. I collect keys, notes, books on the region. If you happen to come across any travel... Oh, we do have a note somewhere, don't we? I think we have loads. We have a book of them. Yeah. We have a book of <laughs> books. <laughs> Let's see what we've got for sale. I've got a note from one of the people, I think, that we might be able to sell. Will we buy hey, a small... Well, you, you could sell the shield. Oh. And then I can give you some more. Uh, a shield for gold each. Woohoo! That's all we'll buy. Uh, it, won't, it won't buy the weapons. Maybe another shop will. Nah, give him the shield. Go on. Yeah, here you go, he, mate. He looks like he could do with a shield. What does he have for sale, then? He's got... Oh, a Bardic Hall on Valhalla. That's 12,000. We're a bit short on that. But when neither of us are barred. Oh, yeah. It summons two berserkers. So, what's that? Bar. Oh, no, it's all sort the of barred classes and barbarians. We can't use that either. That's annoying. What else we got here? A ring. Some gems. Some braces. Will they help us? No. No special abilities. Do you need any more bullets? No, I'm good for bullets. Uh, otherwise, yeah, that's it. Mummy's tea, I remember that. That was a kind of that was like a cure thing for something. Kind of what what it was for now. Probably, probably the 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 headache cure, but ah, uh, oh, we can you can do this though. The wooden short on hundred gold. Should we get identified. Can do. I mean, it might make it dearer, like to sell. The Merry Shorthorn was once owned by the half elven bard Prophia Copperfire. She took the small instrument everywhere. Despite its rather meager powers, the Merry Shorthorn is amongst the most well travelled magic items in Faerun. Just talking. Oh, it is believed that Prophia took it with her to a number of elemental places to Asidium and Bartor, and from the spine of the world to the distant reaches of Wa. It entertained Pashas in the Kalam Sham, quelled the anger of Holy Slayers in Zakara, and bolstered the crew of sailors in the Sea of Fallen Stars. The Merry Short Horn was lost when Prophia accidentally dropped it somewhere in the great desert Anor. So it's only usable by a bard, blessed once per day, Addies received plus one to hit, plus one to saves. Nah. They seem to like bards in this shop, don't they? In everywhere. What's the value of it now, though? Let's have a look. 1,260. Nice. And we can sell it to him. Times 10. We made, we made uh, 10 yeah. times profit on that. Nice, that was nice. Good business deal. Yeah. Should we sell it? Yeah. Neither of us are a bard. That gives us 1,600. Did I have a note in here? No. There's a mage further on we can try and sell this spell to. Um, and I've got some gems in here, I think. Will you buy them? 
Shut it, Slim. 126 gold for them, Jims. 171. Nice. Sell it. So we've got 1,800 gold there. There's nothing from this store we actually need, but that might get us something decent in the next place, might it? Yeah. Nice. Nice. Shut it, Slim. <laughs> Throwing axes. Oh, hello. Oh. Are you going to do la the ladies? Go on. You oh. do the lady. Okay, I'll speak to you as a... I heard... Wait. <laughs> I heard there was a stranger in town. But I didn't believe it. You <laughs> can't think even. How did you get through? <laughs> what is your name? MJ? <laughs> oh. Hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Shama! <laughs> uh, uh, we Shama were part Seven. of an expedition from East Haven, but not all of us made it. My sympathies for your fallen comrades. What happened? <laughs> uh, the past slowed in and make things worse. There's a horde of creatures in the piles. Most of the goblins and horse. I doubt my caravans will be through for quite some time. We froze. You're froze. Am I going to get kicked off in a second? Oh, I hope not. Because nothing's changed on my screen. Yeah, Nothing's... I've noticed. I'm inside the other map. I've got a feeling I'm going to be dropped in a second. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Get. Why? 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 What? Uh, okay. Uh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. There we go. Where are you? Um, come back into that room, Lee, because I can't see my screen now. I'm inside that room. Oh, you are? Yeah. Uh, have you not got... I gave you permission. Oh. No, that's still... That's weird. One second, what's going on here? Let me start a new conversation with Nate, and then you do that farewell. Yay. There we go. Yeah. Thank you. Who's he? Oh, we don't need to... Oh, wait. Oh, where, where is he? I didn't mean to click on you. Archdruid of Kaldahar's friend. There is no Archdruid of Kaldahar. I hope you didn't travel through the past to find one. Hell, your journey's been in vain. Is there anyone? Another druid, perhaps? That might know for certain? Well, there's old Arundel. Well, that's who we wanted. Where is this Arundel? Is in the southwest section of town? There's a two-story house embedded into the tree. Looks like a big stone wall with a door. That's Arundel's house. Just down southeast of Kaldahar Run. I may look for him then. I had more questions first. All right, oh. Uh, there we go. What? Right. <laughs> you did. I have more questions first. Why? Turn the walk away. Just um, leave him there. Oh, let me click on you to follow. I'm going to grab, uh, grab the thing out of the fridge. Uh, right back. I'll be right back. Oh, the bee buck. I'll be right back. I'll be, I'll be right back.
Up to the path we go. So then we go somewhere around here, I think. Yeah. This is the mage building, I think. This is a tower. Yeah. We nog. We nog. I few no sneak up on we nog like that. <laughs> oh, someone commented. Your drunk voice made me want to drink a beer. <laughs> <laughs> Who did a drunk voice? Well, I'm the only one who's drinking beer, so. Ah. Hey, a drunk voice. That's his normal voice. <laughs> Oh, goblin scum, prepare to die, you filthy runts. Who are you? Who lives here? Uh, who are you? Me, we now. Oh, you. <laughs> I am Podge of Slim and Podge. Of Waffle <laughs> and Coffee. <laughs> I get Waffle and Coffee. Of. Uh, <laughs> the other you names. <laughs> I'm saying chalk and cheese now, that one. <laughs> I'm Slim and Pod of <laughs> Waffle and Coffee. <laughs> Mate, they're all gone. There was four variations, and I've forgotten them. <laughs> Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Well remembered, Slim. <laughs> what was the last one? The actual names. <laughs> Slim and Podge, Waffle and Coffee, Mac and Cheese. Oh, there was another one, yeah. Big and, um, big and Mac, that one, it was it? No. That's Mac and cheese, no. Oh. <laughs> Lee's drunken voice with you. Uh, oh. We had, we had, we had a little thing going, Christina, where we had duo names and I've come. I've just forgotten them all. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've watched the previous, previous part of this one now, the beginning of it. Ah. As we know, just sits there staring at me, going, <laughs> "What is he talking about now? What are you having this conversation with? Who is he talking to? <laughs> I have no idea." We know he does this every time. He looks into the distance and he says he's talking to an audience. <laughs> something called a camera. <laughs> Apparently, there's in his head a something called a Twitch stream. Uh. Oh. I think he's communicating with some outer-worldly being. Yeah. That's all I can think. He says people talk to him in this world as well. <laughs> now tower belong to master. We like only serve and clean tower. Make beds cook lazy food for the master. <laughs> the master? Who is your master? Orak, the master, great wizard. The master is we not serve the master, so no one can be great wizard too. I see. <laughs> Where might I find this great wizard? The master is in the study. Oh, I'm starting to go like um. <laughs> the master is in the study. Yeah, Rossiferian Yoda. Yeah. <laughs> Good door. Go in if you want to speak to the master. No, no, no. You're going into your Asian territory now, Rara. We oh, are not allowed nice. in the study. Master keep on problem magic in there. Where is this guy from? <laughs> Books, papers, the wizard are things that the we not can understand. <laughs> yeah, Thanks, you sound Wiener. like Jar Jar B. <laughs> yeah, that's, I can hear that in my head now, Jar Jar. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, it doesn't sound happy, though. Quite a, nice, <laughs> quite a nice tower, though. Yeah, very tall. Mm. <laughs> very, very towery. <laughs> <laughs> now we don't have one nose. <laughs> oh. uh, I'm going upstairs, Podge. <laughs> she says you totally lost it. No, wait, He's I'm Podge. You're, you're Slim. <laughs> going upstairs, Slim. Stop calling me you. <laughs> I'm not you. <laughs> you lost it. He has lost it, hasn't he, Christina? 
he has totally she's talking, lost it. She's talking to you. <laughs> oh, this is a funky room. What's in this room, Christina? Oh, hello. Who's this? This is Auric the Grey. How oh, Auric? I said, oh, Auric. <laughs> Both of you. Uh... How dare you? I mean, all I have to say is it takes one to know one. <laughs> <laughs> Warring blue sticks to you. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but uh, well now, what have we here? It's been a long time since I've had guests. Welcome. My name is Auric. What brings you to my humble home? What brings you to his humble home? This is you talking to him. I'm I'm just now looking at the books with my phone just going. <laughs> right, right, right. He, he's, he's not very talkative, this one. At least he's talking to an audience, whatever that is. Yes. Um, I, would, I would like to ask you some questions about the, the stomach season of ours. Oh, why I'm speaking like William Shatner, I have <laughs> no idea. Um, by me. Oh, yes. The disturbances. I'm afraid I can't be of much help to you there. I rarely leave this tower for any reason, you see. My studies prevent me from talking and active, taking an active interest in the affairs of people who could, uh, Their problems are no concern of mine. Right, but you live in Toda, huh? Uh, how can you not care what happens to the, pe at the town and its people? I've had many homes. Kola is not the first, and suddenly why be the last. It is unfortunate these simple folk have been made to suffer so, but I have no desire to get involved. All that matters to me is my work. Eh, I understand you're busy, but what? Uh, but could you at least offer some assistance in a way of spells or scrolls? I've been willing to pay, of course. I see. Well, uh, you've come to the right place. I can certainly provide you with a number of useful spells for your spell book. Oh, yeah, yeah. You see, he's talking to you now. You're going to talk back. Talk about spells and all this malarkey. I am currently streaming. <laughs> God knows what this streaming is. <laughs> yeah, I have no fucking idea either. <laughs> uh, of course, I'm only willing to offer you certain spells. I fear much of knowledge I possess beyond your comprehension. You're, that's a bit racist. Is that and and, and heightist? Is that because I am like four foot lower than you and I'm black? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Perhaps in the version you could be worthy of such advanced knowledge. You mean? Oh, oh! I just want to. I just want to punch you in the gonads. Punk. Very well, what do you have to offer me at the end of What uh, What would you want? Oh yeah, I can't see what's on the screen. What's on there? Well, in fact, I'll leave and you can talk to him because there's not really anything. I, I'm a uh, cleric, so everything I have is natural. Unlike I'm... you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a see what he's got inside then. Inside? Oh, I'm gonna I leave you be alone. Let's <laughs> so see if we can buy this. 80 gold for that reflected image scroll, which I've already learned. Mm -hmm. I'll take that for now, oh, yeah. That's done. What what's your uh, what's your doing that? Oh wow, there's quite a bit here, isn't there? There's a bag of holding, but that's twelve thousand gold. Uh, so that, that bag of holding, we can put all our that, weapons in that, I mean, it really is worth it. I mean, especially this early. We can't afford it yet. What do you mean we can't afford it? It's 12,000. Oh, oh I'm sorry. I thought you said 100. Sorry. No, no. Yeah. That, that, that'd be what Santa's waiting for. We've got the scarab. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like, you get it. <laughs> um, yeah. 
And it, not, and not usable by a bard, druid, fighter, mage, paladin, ranger, shaman, thief. So anyone. <laughs> anyone. You can, um, can you use it if yeah. you're a cleric? Yeah. If you're a thief, ain't you? are a thief cleric. Both. Cleric and thief. So, either. I, right. need, I need a quick wee. One sec. I'm about to say that. I've just been messaged to grab a coffee. One sec, bud. Okay. I'll be right back as well. Stay with us, people. Listen to the, the the wonderful calming music of uh, Slim. Apparently, <laughs> I'll be right back. Be right back. Oops. Oops, a days. There we go. Get that back. Um. So, I'm just trying to work out so cute. Um. Oh, no, I don't do that then. Turn it off. Yo, yo, yo. Hello. Where is it? There he is. <laughs> uh, Ooh, has she so said anything that hasn't been insulting tonight? <laughs> she did buy us some... Um... So, okay. Yeah, so it's a bit, it's a bit of like a dominatrix happening in here. <laughs> oh, we've got some like robes here. Scarab, this girdle of gond, clasp of bronze coat, all too dear for us right now. Fine, familiar. I could have a, f a familiar, couldn't I? As a mage fire? Yeah. Yeah. It's not essential yet, is it? But I don't know what uh, neutral is. Might be yeah. a rabbit or a cat. A bouncing rabbit. I wonder if there's anything on here. Uh, here we go, neutral. True neutral. And we're chaotic okay. neutral. Cat. We are a cat. So we get 12 hit points, armor class 2, magic resistance 35%. I don't really want a cat walking around with me just yet. Charming. Um, Charming. What are we gonna do with it? What do you mean what you're gonna do with it? You don't no. do anything with it. It it does things. I I've got time for a cat yet, Slim. You, you always say that, but you always got a first for furry things, so <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'm so trying to think what that bloody name was. Oh, Cat's Grace. Do I want this? What's this? Oh, oh all right. Yeah, yeah. You Increased don't want a cat. Security. You want to walk like one. Mm -hmm. 
If I get this, this will put my dexterity to 20. I've got 19 dex because of my elven thing. If I add that spell and used it, that put me onto 20 dexterity. What would be the benefits of that? That increased my range, my range of when it the bone arrow. I won't buy any spells yet. Then if you, oh, actually, it might be worth getting web. Yeah, web's definitely a good one. Because we could at least keep some at a distance from us. I was gonna say like web, the entangle spell, you know, the vines. Oh, I can't click on it for some reason. Hmm. I can't click on anything to buy. Okay. Yeah. Oh no. Let me just make sure that you've got all the missions. You should do. Yeah, you do. I just sold, didn't I? Oh, all right, well... <laughs> oh. I had a container to open painting on this side. Caused the issue. Um, right. Right. You didn't um, have space. Web... Um, we've got orb now. I haven't got identify. Mirror. Where's that gone? Uh, I did see that on there actually. Just, yeah, just above uh, familiar. Okay. That's 360. Um, that's it, really, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, shield might be good for you as well, but that's it. Shield would work because I could drop the armor, couldn't I? Yes, yeah, for when you're yeah, casting spells. But you only you have limited amount of first level or second level spells, so I've only got two slots at the moment, yeah. That's what I mean, so um We'll do that then, because that gives us a thousand steel if we want to see if we can upgrade a weapon. There's a there's a smithy round the corner, I think. Thought it was in Brian. <laughs> Did you chuck all your stuff in for me to sell as well? After? Uh, I've given you everything I'm not going to use, yeah. Cool. Oh, actually, yeah, there's that as well. Uh, oh, that's going to be worth money. Someone collects these in the game. Um, oh. Cool. Great, I can skin them when we get to them. Yeah. Yeti pelts as well. You can make your own armour out of the Yeti pelts, if I remember right. Yeti and wolf pelts, and then you have to spend like 10,000 gold with it, and you get this special cold resistant um, armor that it, it really slows you down. Um, but it benefits from cold damage, so you could use it in certain combats, I guess. Mm. If we go that route, money wise. Um, can you do a quick save before I try and learn these? Cheers, man. Yeah. Um, cool. That one worked. That one worked. I'm hoping that 18 is enough to learn most spells. That one worked. Cool. Right. What do you mean 18? Because if you've got like a 16, you can sometimes foul spells. My intelligence right. is 18, so it should be hopefully enough yeah. to pass most spell spells. Um, sweet. So we'll go and speak to that guy, and we'll come back here later if we need to buy these other bits if we can. And we need to remember to keep books and parchments and notes and stuff to sell to that other guy. Okay. This guy here, he likes to buy books and stuff. Oh yeah, that is that what he calls it. <laughs> Let's go and speak to Arendelle if he's down here. Get out of my way, love. Sounds like a hyena. Oh, really? 
Oh, it's something cross between a hyena and a kookaburra. It's game at atmospherics. Oh, yeah, that noise. Hmm? That. <laughs> yeah, that noise. <laughs> Which in, in, in Denmark means, you know, uh, what is it? Voodoo, 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 vaku, vuku, shave, vuku, swa. I can't speak French. No, voodoo, no. vuku, shave, avec, was, ce soir. That's that, 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 yeah. Voodoo, vuku, shave, avec, was, ce soir. You know what that means, right? We go to bed, me, innit? Right, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, that, you know. How about you pick up your coat? Because you have just got laid. I mean, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Arundel, yay! We finally made it, and he's he's speaking to you, not me. Why is he speaking? To, why does everyone speak to me? Is it because he's always talking to his Twitch audience or something? It's because we're in a, a world that's accepting of everybody, and he feels like he should speak to the short ass rather than the tall Elven. So he's like, I'm going to speak to this guy. I don't want to be like short phobic. Well, is it because I'm black and you just feel like it's the most cool person in the room? You do. All right, cool. Oh, you are, yeah. I'm a dark elf. Uh, no, yes. You looked purpley to me. You're colorblind. Racist. <laughs> uh, all right. All right. Are you going to do him? He does his voice himself, but does I think he? he's yeah. I think he's he's got his own speaking. Yeah, when you answer, he'll talk. Wow. When he does it, add all the headphones up to the mic so they can hear what he says. All right. Expecting us? How is that possible? We've only just arrived in town. Wait, I thought it was our uncle who sent us. <laughs> you must be Arundel. Did it work for the? Yeah. Yeah, and Podgy wouldn't remember him anyway. He doesn't even remember our titles. You are the Archdruid, eh? Ah. That must mean that you're a pillar of society. Da -da um, then I assume that you can tell me what's going on around here. So everyone who loses their sense of hearing, do you just like banish them from your town? Oh, oh, that type of death. Oh. <laughs> you know about the avalanche? Oh, no, no accident. Someone saw me. Oh, someone's after us. Someone's trying to kill us. They're picking us up one by one. Why would they attack us? We are Slim and Podge. What's yeah. wrong with Bobby? It's it's <laughs> making cheese and cheese. another name. <laughs> Loose and flop. Yeah, yeah flip and flop is Loose what you said. Yeah, there That's you it. go. I mean, all, all forum is what you said. So I don't know what I'm saying. Um, guys, right, so what's going on around here, old man? Yeah, I mean, it, it, it's Seravox voice. It's the guy who done Seravox. So you might as well just do Seravox voice. Uh, Malevolent forces. Could you be more specific? <laughs> specific. Oh, 
on about us. There are signs of its damaging influence on the balance. The unnatural weather, the recent wash of adaptions, and numerous monsters sighted in the past. Sighted in the past. These all point towards something sinister. Even the animals sense something is amiss. Uh, could you tell me uh, more about these disturbances? <sighs> I can only tell you what it's all I know. And which disturbances would have we speak of? Tell me of uh, the unnatural weather. Uh, the weather in these mountains has always been a bit harsh, but never like this. Fish storms ravage the bodies without warning, often lasting for several days at a time before vanishing as quickly as they come. I mean, we're used to that. We yeah. live below ground, don't you know? Lethal. Leaf. We still don't make eye contact, do we? You wonder if she got you back to him. <laughs> I'm looking at his crutch. You're looking at the. I thought I could see your eyes and beard. No, no, I'm looking at the crutch. So I'm looking at the back of you, am I? Yeah, he's holding the shield in his right arm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought the shield was in the left arm. Not for him. He's left handed. You're making this up now. Look at his feet. Oh, yeah. To be honest, that's all I've been basing it on. Yeah, he's <laughs> everything else I've just been put BSing, but yeah, I'm going by his feet. Yeah, but his feet are facing that way, so he's facing on towards me. <laughs> he's looking away from him. <laughs> I'm looking at the shadow of his crutch. <laughs> 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 All right, so yeah, can you can you tell me more about this disturbances? Uh, this abductions. Ah, terrible, terrible. Travelers. Yes. So, yes. what, like, what we've been doing? Great. Uh. Charming. I don't know how they feel about the homeless then. No. Sheamish. Poor old Conlon. He probably ran away because of what his parents named him. <laughs> That's strange indeed. His name, <laughs> not the fact that he went missing. Okay. Oh no. You would be. You would be, wouldn't you? Ugh. No one has heard from you since. Ah. Oh no. Well, we're not going to get a, a brandy from that. No. Is there anyone left in this town? <laughs> you spoke before a balance. What sort of balance do you talk about? Mm. Is it All like right. a blank balance? <laughs> it's starting to sound like a cult. <laughs> Ah. So what you're trying Ooh. to say is you would have married an owl bet. <laughs> is it coming together as two parts of, a, of an owl? That sounds like Gurf's yeah. wife. <laughs> you know Gurf very well then. <laughs> you take this thing to think very seriously. <laughs> <don't you? laughs> 
Ah. I thought it was because of brick and mortar. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Shred? What shred are you talking about? Ah, that tree. A lot of what you're saying sounds so semi heroic And who's this tall Ben? Now it's that well again. There's a lot of balance in this one, isn't there? Yeah. <laughs> balance. I see. So, uh, what are we here to do about any of this? You remember. Oh, the balance. The balance. The you would love balance. a guy in East Haven called Everard. <laughs> the, what's that? The circle of water for from the Great Oak. What's that? The balance. <laughs> I don't think you know how science works, mate, right? Look, I know I may have lived under a rock my whole life, right? But I don't think that a giant tree provides the only warmth to the entire of the world. Just to Kaldahar. Just just, just uh, oh right, right. Get, hello Gavin Devine, welcome. Ah, oh. I thought you start talking about death in there. Get that from the other guy, Elverwood. <laughs> Everyone he spoke to died. Can I use your chair, please, mate? Because I'm starting to lose my balance. <laughs> it's too much balance. There's too much balance in it's this game. Too much balance. 
<laughs> what help you? <laughs> Gavin Devine is from Brazil. <laughs> Oi, tudo bang. So I remember now. I've forgotten most of that Brazilian. Eu now lembro um, Brazil Brazilian. Um, <laughs> At least fala. you're trying. Eu now lembro fala Brazil. <laughs> I like that, but it really isn't anything I can do to help. Very well, together we shall approve this evil. That's part mm -hmm. of this town. What must we do? What? Hero mode or uh, nah? Now nah, we've got to help him because we want the coin. We want right. them cool items from that shop. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> Hashtag. Bowen ready. I'm, I'm sorry, Arundel. Could you repeat that? Like he, he's he's he, he, he's throwing <laughs> random words out again, mate. He's saying things like hashtag whilst playing with his bowstring. I, hashtag I'm, bow I'm, and ready. I'm, I'm re he's talking to the brick wall again, Arundel. Like, please, <laughs> have you got a potion to help him? I think he took a bit of a two hit to the noggin. Like he's, he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. Uh, I suggest you begin investigating the Valley of Shadows. It's a place not far from here. That, that's always a guide to the floor. It's small canyon. As a light, sometimes we're the ones we're wearing the place. Yeah. <laughs> Our world map has been updated. Right, so we're, he, he's saying, let's go to the Valley of Shadows. Wait, Valley of Shadows? Isn't that... Um... Doesn't sound very welcome. The, the Dark Inquisitor place. For uh, Harry Potter. Oh, no, so, is it Saluna? Saluna? Saluna. Yeah, the the goddess of darkness. Yeah, the moon god, isn't it? Yeah, the moon goddess. Yeah. I don't know. Trust you. I He was dead. He awoken. Literally, oh dear. a few days ago, arrow through his head. Oh, wait. He... Uh, Aaron, there was you trying to raise more girthy people. <laughs> Well, what about you? Are we literally just here to t like tidy up the mess that you just created? As always, send it to the little man. It's upstairs. Are you? Are you? Are you is, was, is that sarcasm? That's a fancy room. He's got. He's got a purple like bed lamp. Hmm. It's quite a nice little apartment there, isn't it? Yeah, give me a second. Is there anything to search? Because if there is, I can just take, whip that off. It doesn't look like it, does it? Oh, what a waste of time. I'm looking what? again. Um, Slim, yeah. Why are you getting naked? I'm Next always naked. It's a comfy looking bed, uh, but. Just, uh, just wiping my sweaty self all uh, over it. It's like, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Nature. Nature. Come on, go down the stairs, Podge. Go down the stairs. Ah, oh, Podge. I wonder why he was, he was like staring at the stairs for ages. Podge, what are you doing, Podge? Well, that can't be right. You're not right. <laughs> <laughs> You're not right in the head. What's with those big head boys? There we go. Whee! Ready? Yep. Good. Get out of the way. Go down the stairs. Move it. Move it. 
Damn it! There we go. <laughs> All right, we're back to normality. Here we go. Ooh. God, is that the wind blowing down from the crevices? That's what she said. It's been a while. <laughs> There's a bridge there and we didn't use it. What's that over there? Let's try and get this bottom map open. I don't know, but one might say it's a bridge too far. <laughs> oh. Oh. The ice is appearing. It's not going to attack us here. I don't trust this bit. Mm. Is it a dead end? Dead end. Dead end, that's worth it. As Pink Panther says. Dead end. Dead end. Dead end, dead end. That is a very um. Do you know anything of the Veil of Shadows? Oh, ask Miric. He and his brother Silas made a pilgrimage there every year. They should. Oh, they should be back soon, actually. Don't go stepping foot into the Valley of Shadows. It's not a place for the living. As long as the dead mind their own affairs, we mind ours. Oh. What if you're undead? Uh, then you'll probably fit in. Oh. In memory of Archdruid Tolbin, founder of Kaldahar. Do a quick save, bud. Didn't I want? Yeah. The music's making me feel a bit sleepy. Yeah. Like, what's going on here? It feels like someone wants 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 to do some damage to us soon. No. Looks nice and cozy. Ooh. Have you got anything to say to us? Why by the hills? I wasn't expecting any faces in Cold Hall with the passes at being what they are. You for me, Stephen. One sec, mate. I've got to go and pick mum up from the hospital after her tests. Who was we? Uh, ah, then you've just been like walking into everyone's house. So that's Aaron. Oh. Someone shattered us. Run! The veil's filled with yetis. Oh, uh, we go. I think we're going to be attacked by yetis. Okay. And yeti. Where are they? That's all right. Can you Maybe. stealthily place a trap? On there, and then pull them away. Oh god, we're gonna die! Wait, one sec, I'll shoot. We'll try and shoot one of them for distance. Ah, I'm running. 
Like no chance of killing that. I ain't got no special abilities either. Little guy versus giant guy and like... Look at the oh. size difference of yours. Yeah, oh, nice right. Just smash his toes, Slim. Oh, these two people just chatting. <laughs> Call for help or something. Oh. Ooh. You're doing mine's, all right. Mine's near death. He knocked three hit points off me. Oh, he's, not, he's hit me again. Oh. oh, oh. Yes. Oh. Nice. Cool, look nice. at that. 15 damage with my bow and arrow. Yeah. Nice. We go pick up that. I don't know if you pick it up. It's quite heavy, oh, yeah, I think. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for the help. I did help you. No, not you. Oh, these? Yeah. Right. What have we got here? Um, Yeti pelt or wolf pelt? Hey. We need somewhere to rest. Has he got a name, that bloke? Mirik. Oh, Mirik. That's what she mentioned, wasn't it? The guys who went over there. So, thank you. I thought... The time to join my ancestors had finally come. Last time I ever stepped foot anywhere near the Val. Oh, nice. That's where we're going. That's for certain. There's all sorts of strange creatures roaming around there. The Val? The Val of Shadows. My brother Silas and I made a pilgrimage there to pay our respects to our family crypt. Like we do every year. But this time, I don't know. The Val seems different. Cursed somehow. The shadows have come alive. And there's yetis roaming the pass, attacking travellers. I was there. You wouldn't have guessed. Your brother, where is he? Silas didn't make it. The largest yeti oh. I've ever seen tore out from the snow and took a piece out of him with his claws. He fell dead as a stone, blood everywhere. There was nothing I could do. He was carrying our family heirloom, but it's lost to us now. Oh, no. Where was this heirloom? <laughs> yeah. Maybe we can sell it back to you at a reasonable price. <laughs> can we try and recover it for you? We were taking the main path, but considering how many beasts were in the Val, Arendelle may know a safer path you can take. He wanders the mountains quite a bit and knows of more hidden trails than there are branches on the Great Oak. His home is southwest. We've already spoken to him. Thank you. Now that Silas is gone, that heirloom is all I have left to remember my family by. I would appreciate its safe return. Also, if you come across any more yetis, you might want to collect their pelts once you've done away with the beast. Conland, the blacksmith, here in town, buys the pelts for a fair price. Yeah. Cool. Auric may be able to make something out of those two. Right, yes, yeah, so that's what I you about the wolf pelts and the thingy pelts. I think you take him to him, he makes the pelts, and then you take him to the mage, and he magic does magic to him. Makes him cold resistant and stuff. It costs does quite a bit of money. Him, yeah? Yeah. Does magic. Does a little bit of magic to him. Does a little bit of magic to him. I've got a law of zero, all right? I know all the words in the books of words. <laughs> You're I'm the smart one. you even know what a book is. Yes, I know what a book is. It's the thing made of that stuff. <laughs> uh, You're the smart one. I'm the one that does like things. Did, I mean, did you call your bow Twitch? <laughs> it is now Twitch. When I stream, I do my bow and go like that. <laughs> What's in here? Am I going to... Is it, this is the same house that you broke into before. This is a new one. That's one. It's not. That one it's the same house that you broke into. That's that one. Go go in. I'll, uh, see if you've already broken in it. Or oh, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> Heroes. All right, easy there, mate. First, first buys dinner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, are you talking to me? Sorry, mate. Uh, what are you talking about? Ah. Ah. Uh, what would an orc want with us? Oh no, it's not the it's not the white hand, is it? <laughs> Sorrow man. Split play, what you want from us? <laughs> so I, again, plain speak, you what you want us to be your security guard. Fair enough. Correct. <laughs> Cheek. Speaking the truth, though, mate, any? Why, why say I want you for this quest? Oh, it'll be the greatest thing ever, but you're not ready for it. Why tell us? Why we not approach us when, if we're from your dreams, why not come to us when your dreams say that we're ready? Yeah. You punker. Just beat you around the bush. You're just showing off. You just saying, "Oh, I know things you don't." I mean, we just beat two yetis an hour, two like two or three days ago. We, we yeah, couldn't even, we couldn't mean, even get an orc. We, we, we slayed, slayed them. We didn't beat them. We slayed them. So we certainly bit short, didn't right? beat them off. <laughs> we we've got, them off. We we've got to return to this guy later on in the game when we've completed a lot of missions. And this takes you into the heart of winter expansion. Oh, it takes you into the heart of winter. Mm, in a place expansion. called Icewind Dow. Uh -huh. That's always winter. <laughs> <laughs> it's twice as much winter. <laughs> Extra winter. Oh, look, and there's the door to go to. Oh, hello. Go on. I can't click on it. Oh, God. Get out of the way then. I can't let you in the way. God. See, you just move him out of the way. You just take it, you see? What was it? Yeah. It's a, a really good sling. <laughs> um, it's really? I think it, yeah, I think it needs to be identified, though, so I'll give it to you. Because you here is as the identify spell. All right, so before we do stuff, I could... We could we could murder someone and then sleep in the house. I've got two identified once we rest. Um That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I said we could murder someone and sleep oh. in the house. Uh it only costs one gold piece to sleep in an inn. Yeah, it costs nothing to kill someone. It costs our integrity. <laughs> our integrity. How can yeah. we be? How can we be? Because our integrity. <laughs> Root cellar tavern. Oh wait, no, no, wait, yeah, right, Randy, uh, Randy from South Park, integrity farms, integrity. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, hello. I need to be identified, but I'm going to give that to you for a sec because you've got a potion bag. But there's a potion that we might need to identify. Yes, I do. That looks like um, a vial of poison. Hmm. Where'd she go? Oh, she's there. I don't know. Is she important? Um, it's just the same words again, isn't it? Yeah, yeah fallen comrades. 
Let's get out of this one. Oh, yeah, woes me. Woes you. We just almost got squished, eaten, and uh, probably you know, everything out of a way of being hurt. No one person helped us. Yeah, no, no, no. Bit of sus. Bit of sus. Goodbye. It's a nice house, though. Yeah, yeah. nothing to steal, though. No. Well, they so got it's not that nice. Anyone in names there? They just townspeople, just townspeople. I don't, I don't know, but just go through the door. We'll find out. <laughs> like people behind us. It's funny because it'd be like in every scene, they both try and go through the same doorway at the same time. Every time it's like, oh, just let me, let me, just, you got, just move back, move back. All right, all right. Now, I'll go, just go, just go. Just, just go. <laughs> would you like a drink from the cellar? The name's Whitcomb. Yes, a drink would be nice. We ah. would like some brandy. Comoran brandy. What else they got here? That's new drinks here. Tree sap. Well, that sounds interesting. I certainly don't want no fiddle bender. <laughs> Especially when it says it's a mystery brew. No, I'm gonna thank go you. I'll have some tree set. I'll go. I'll go with Cormor and Brandy, please. We've heard tower goblins and ogres in Cold Hard Pass, but whoever's been take, taken off with our townsfolk don't leave tracks like goblins or ogres. All right, so it's not the ogres and the goblins taking people. What did you want? I want the 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 the, the brandy. Brandy. Yeah. We can make owl from the tree sap of the great oak of colder heart. It's warm like cider. I've just had some and fitting. The aftertaste is like smelling a corn coniferous tree, though. After it's been cut, it's hard to brew, though, and takes a while. That's lovely. Yeah. There's nothing that isn't nice about that. Yeah. That sounds delicious and would smell wonderful. I just had some as well. Ah. Colder heart tree sap. You can have a drink if you want as well. Just had a brandy. <laughs> These women, I think we've got to speak to. Lyson. Welcome, Traveller. May I be of service to you? I would like to ask you some questions. I will help you if I can. What would you like to know? Who are you? I'm Lyson, the barmaid. I may be of service to you. He <laughs> wink, wink, uh, nudge, nudge. <laughs> what do you do here, Lyson? As I said, I'm a barmaid. I help take care of the customers. Hello. I serve food and drinks, chat with folks, and listen to what they have to say. You learn a lot if you take the time to listen. Rude. <laughs> Since you say that. Have you heard any rumors to share with me? Wow, she has. Oh, me. <laughs> well, I hear towels. Folks have taken, have been talking about the recent avalanche, the haunted vow, missing folks, monsters, and Arundel. Right. Haunted vow. Fill me in. Most folks call it the Vow of Shadows. It's always dark there, like twilight or a moonlit night. Anyway, there are those who say spirits of the dead wander the Vow. Folks don't go there anymore. They're afraid to. Maybe someone should do something about that. Right, we will be going there. Um, tell me about the missing people, please. <laughs> Can you smell coniferous trees? That's my breath. <laughs> Just add one of your tree saps. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Ah, folks have been vanishing without a trace. <laughs> I recall something about a man's wife gone missing. He packed up and left his home and all to go find her. Another is the Smithy's young son. You might want to talk to him if you have an interest. Smithy has a son? Hmm. Uh, monsters? I saw a subject... Oh, pardon one... me. It might smell of brandy. <laughs> <laughs> they met the orcs and goblins. And the... Well, we've dealt with some orcs and goblins, actually. So, um... Maybe you'll see a bit less of them. We also killed two yetis. Did you, if you didn't know about that. What's and this? yet. Hey. And yet. Oh, yet, D. I've just got the joke. <laughs> it's a lot of yeah, it was bad, so I allow it. Tell me about the avalanche. I hear it was a bad one. That joke. <laughs> there aren't many good avalanches, dear. Um, like that joke. What, your, the avalanche. Yeah, it was the joke. That was the avalanche. <laughs> oh, is that bad? 
Some I'm folks killed. are trapped here and none too happy about it. Not much that can be done, though. No, it can't. Um, missing people. Hi, folks have been vanishing. Oh, we've, uh, you told me that already, though. Um, <laughs> something else. What about the tavern? This is the best tavern in Kaldahar. Is it the only tavern in Kaldahar? <laughs> the food is good. <laughs> the hours are watered down and the service is friendly. Ah, so, and that makes it the best. <laughs> Thank you. And Amelia. Did she just leave the building after talking to me? Yep. She's the mermaid there. <laughs> Was. <laughs> I'm quit after our conversation. <laughs> you have that effect on people. <laughs> She's angry. Uh, angry me? and violent. What the hell are you blabbing about, woman? Ha! Huh. I'm just surprised to see a new face in Calder, I was all. I thought I'd never see another customer. The past buried in the, in the snow as it is. I've Looks got like another bar mate. Is. Another one. Maybe she'll quit after the one to you as well. <laughs> we want a meal. <laughs> Tell that filthy goated wine spider squatting behind the bar to stop drinking the stock and fire up the oven. Your best shout. He's too deep in his... All right. Um, do you know where I can find a room? Well, you're in and out of luck. We don't have any rooms, but that pug knows knee high at the evening shade. All the winners, some rooms to let. If you're interested, better hope you have enough coin, though. I doubt a pile of gold would be enough for that copper clenching mole. I take it you don't like halflings. It's nothing to do with him being half a man. If so, then most of Kolahar would be guilty. It's his manner, that ill mannered excuse for a gunning sack came into ownership of that inn recently. And it's queer thing how he did too. How so? Well, the previous innkeeper, Iden, is one of the folks who's gone missing of the late. Thing is, he is one of the only ones that seems to know he was gone, was going missing, because he left a claim onto who passed the hint onto in case he needed to be put to sleep with a shovel. Go on. And barely a day after he's gone, Aldwin shows up, like a winter wolf out of the fresh fallen snow, with the claim in his paws. And sets up shop pretty as you please. Mm. Sounds That's like nice. one man for Very sus indeed. Mm. Well, I knew Iden, and the fool was a, was a right enough fellow, but he had the palsy so bad he couldn't even write his own name, much less a claim. And that's even if he was in the know about letters, which he wasn't. I see. Interesting. Maybe I'll ask all good about the claim he has. In the meantime, where would I? Find a mill, not gonna ask you that again. Um, <laughs> expedition, I'll just update you that now. Let's just say, so Alden presented a claim that seemed to indicate that Ida knew he was going away. So she thinks it's just like a, a scam that he maybe killed him because Ida could have yeah, right. right, yeah, and he's got palsy. So it wouldn't have been a good written letter. Yeah. I don't know. I don't mean we've had our share of readers before, but this year's been worse. Mm. How so? Maybe she killed him and she'd point the finger. Could be. You could, it's weird. Oh, it's early enough. Business partner made there. One of them's buggered off as soon as they saw people asking questions. <laughs> a lot of strange going on. Folks worried. Might want to speak to Arundel. Uh, already dead. Already did, yeah. We just want to go to sleep now. We uh, just no want room. a room. And you're going to give us a room, so see you later. I'm just going to she's saying the same stuff again. Can we get out of this conversation somehow? Thanks. It'd be very helpful. Yeah, you've been so helpful. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we need to get uh, out of a room. <laughs> The only owl in that house is, you know, the one that's painful. <laughs> Ooh. Ow. Ooh. Ooh. Ow. Ooh. Ow. 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 I think this is the Smithy house. Is it? 
This don't look like Hove. <laughs> There's an anvil there, isn't it? Yeah, blacksmith. Yeah. There's no coyote here, though. Oh, no, I don't know for that, just in case it kills me. Oh, go on. Welcome, stranger. I thought that's a colon, then. <laughs> Greetings, my name is Podge. This is yes, Slim, you are. as Slim and Podge. Yes, I am. Otherwise known as Waffle we and are. Coffee. As well as... Mac and Cheese. As well as... Flip and Flop. As well as... Tina and Turner. <laughs> oh, it's because I make them gay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Conlan. If you're needing a sharp blade or a stout mace, I'm the man to see. Best take advantage while I'm still here. Oh, where are you going? Colon. Is your name Colon or Conlan? Conlan. Uh, colon. Colon on the brain. Colon. Speaking to Girth. Hi, I see. Girthy Colon. <laughs> wow. Girthy Colon. You're leaving Calderhard. Doesn't surprise me. This town is rather dull. Perhaps I could accompany you. Ha! Oh. Ah. I wish that was possible. The Southern Pass has long since been snowed in in this damnable weather we've been having lately. Now I hear tell that even the northern route to the Ten Towns has been blocked by an avalanche. Mark my words, I'm not Mark. Just told you my four different names. Oh, wow. Flat. Yeah. None of us will last through this winter. We're all done exactly, for. Exactly, Jeremy. Yeah, cheerful thought. May I see what is for sale? Yeah. Oh, he's got play now. Has he? Um, a bigger shield for elk shoe, medium shield. Uh, already got a shield. Maces, all regular and normal weapons. I mean, I, you know, sleeping. And then identifying that sling would help. Let me sell that short bow. That, that. Um, uh, I've got a flower I use. Right. I won't sell them just yet. I'll wait for them to activate or say something to us. Right, identify that sling. Yeah. A hundred or we rest and I do it for free. Wait, can you do it for free? I've got two identify spells. I just need to rest. Yeah, yeah. This, uh, let's do that. Well, let's come back to him after then. Well, I didn't find those things. Can't get past you. <laughs> what are you trying to say I'm fat? Calling me fat. <laughs> oh, it's right next door. Shame it's a massive root. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we've got to get to the root of this problem. Oh. That's annoying. Come on, the amount of people coming out of there falling down this if he was drunk. The hill was on this. Yeah, you weren't fall down, you just slide down. <laughs> Whee! I guess the one this is not it's not a bar or anything, I guess. You're certainly not gonna finish it on the pub crawl. <laughs> Aldwin, all right. All right, I, I hear you got a thing for names. Have a look upstairs, Lee. I'm sure there's something upstairs before we can okay. we can blackmail him with. Oh, really? I think there's a letter or, or a ring or something. All right, yeah. let's take off the armor. Somewhere in one of these rooms, I think. Nice. That one's locked, so I need your skills for that one. And that's it, so maybe it's in there. Oh, a ring. I think that's it. The ring, I think that ring's got sank on it. That I right click on the ring. Uh, the simple silver ring bears an inscription on the interior. It looks like the inscription was carved there by an expert silversmith to the people of Kaldahar. Should evening fall upon me and my life be no more, 
I leave the evening shade to you. Please care for her as I did. Iden, last line of Kavon. So it's Ida's ring, which means he's dead. So he killed him. So did he kill him or did someone else kill him? Yeah. So now we can use that against him. Mm. Maybe, or maybe get a cheap room. Um, are you Aldwin? Yes, maybe. Do I know you? Admit, should we get her in trouble as well? Or should we just say it? Oh, right. Uh, the media the barmaid at the root cellar mentioned you. She said you bought this in from a man named Iden before he vanished, that is. A media, that dried up sermon wench with the voice like a harper, yeah? I know her. Yeah, she's right, I did. Buy this place from Iden. I'm beginning to see why the old dodger wanted to sell this in and vanish right quick. Oh, yeah? Why? Well, he stuck me with this hole. Not much business to be had. Winter's choked off all the passes, so that means no caravans and no business. I hope our Iden got buried in a snowdrift or used us or used as a chew bone by an ogre. <laughs> anyway, claim's mine. So I got to make do. Hmm. Something is pretty pretty fishy. Iden wrote the claim to you? Yeah, written in pen and ink, legally binding. Every I dotted, every T crossed for any fool to see. So? Well, Iden had palsy, but you knew that, right? So this claim was written to you? Of course, assuming that Iden knew how to write, which he didn't, then the script would hardly be as perfectly written as you say. Yeah, well, uh, our Eden must have had something... Someone write for him then, because everything looks in order to me. It's not unheard to have others write claims for you. All I know is the claim's mine. Now, do you want a room or not? If not, then get out. Um, what do you think, Slim? Should we leave in a bit? Or maybe we should mention... One other thing. It's one other thing. Uh, something to do with uh, Brown Town. I mean, a ring. <laughs> Rectum. Yes. Ring. Uh, what? Rectum. You know. Oh, right. Well, yep. Human ring. Yep, you know? yep. Yeah. Brown Explain Town. Explain to me. Yeah. What's, what's that got to do with anything? Well, it's a ring. Yep. And we found a ring. Uh, and your butt is clenching. Therefore, I think what my friend is saying to you is, um, he found a ring upstairs, and it had an inscription on the inside. Exactly, that's what I said. With the claim to this inn. So why that's are you, why are you saying something different? Oh, uh, <laughs> so you've. You've stooped to forcing your way into locked containers in people's houses, have you? Before you accuse me of doing something wrong, maybe you should look to yourself. What are you doing breaking and entering? So you knew it was locked upstairs? Uh, no. No. I didn't know it was locked upstairs. Look, I don't have to explain anything. <laughs> Do we want to get him in it, or do we want to threaten him? I, I, think, mean, we can, I think we could take him. Yeah, I mean, threaten him. Look, you sniveling little dog. I'm tired of hearing your lies and your yeah. bluffery. Yeah. I, I could kill you where you stand. Yeah. Probably not with my main weapon, because I ain't got that nailed yet. But with my bow and arrow, I could walk across the room 50 foot, and then I could kill you quite easily. Yeah. Right. Couple of shots, maybe. One will definitely hit first. A couple might miss, but the, eventually you'll be killed. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um. So I can kill you where you stand and claim this in as mine. Never yeah. feel shred of remorse. Now tell me the truth, or I'll set yeah. you outside until you freeze, then carve you like an ice block. Yeah. My carving skills aren't that great, to be honest, mate. So you'd probably look like a carved popsicle. 
Ja. Yeah. Oh, look, look, look. hold on, hold on, hold on. Here's what happened. First off, I never laid a hand on Iden. So Iden is dead. Well, yeah. But it's not my fault. I came into the inn one night after barely making my way through Caldera Pass. See, and there he is, lying on the floor of the inn. Comes uh, the stone. Mm. Now, I've, I've been through the pass before, even talked with the old fool a bit, and I knew he didn't have any family. Uh. So what did you do with the body? There have been rumours of people missing, so I buried the body outside of town, and then well, I dug up some pen and ink and then set up the claim. Granted, I stripped him of his belongings, and I should have thrown away that damn ring, but look, I'm not doing any harm. He didn't have any family, and this town needs an inn. So why did you do it? You probably won't be able to sell this place, you know. The storm season closes off the caravan routes too often to turn any profit. I know, it's just that, I don't know, I'm sick of travelling. And I suddenly got the urge to settle. Blame the half in me. I suppose at least I didn't try to plant myself in some glorified mould burrow and smoke a stinkweed pipe into a dire boredom. Well, actually sounds quite right. Oh, a stinkweed. Yeah, sounds quite advertising. Nothing wrong with living in the burrow. <laughs> Look, Aldwin, I'm just looking for a cheap place for the night or any other night I need to rest. You're just looking for me to keep silent. Sounds to me like we can help each other. That's what works for us, isn't it? Mm. Get what we want. Mm. If we get free a free in forever. Yeah, we don't want cheap. We want it free. Yeah. Yeah. So that's yeah. good. Wow, three thousand experience for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can. I've got lots of empty rooms. I don't see why an extremely quiet guest such as yourself should have to pay for them. I mean, you keep to yourself and don't say a word. No gold needs to change hands in either direction. Perfect. Very well. Show me to my mate. We just got well, we both leveled up. Three thousand yeah. experience. Lee, we got noble room for free, unlimited. Yeah. Ooh. But only in this town. Uh, yeah, only in this, only here. So if you come back to here, but only here. Oh, I can't rest. You've got to do it. So oh, that, okay. Come back off. Uh, let's do yeah, Just, yeah, or not. Yeah, yeah. Why not? Where are you? Why not? Why not? I'm, I'm on the uh, thingy screen. There we go. Oh, I'm upstairs. Oh, yeah. I can't do it. I'll never up there yeah. while you're doing that. I need to rest in one of your free rooms. Yeah, you keep making sure the rooms are free and we won't have any problems. Noble. Well, I've got I've got one. Actually no, I've got two. What's that? Well, Level no, no, I'm not a noble. Oh. What have I got here? Four additional hit points and one level two spell. And you've got, you know... So the choice is what? I can now have web. Too late good. now, but I've got that learned now for next time. And I can now identify those things. Yeah. Do you want to drop me that other thing as well and I'll identify that? Oh, uh, the potion, yeah. That's weird. Identify a spell, but it's not letting me do it. Ah. I've got identify there. Oh, wait, my armor. I've got armor, and I turned on. Identify. There we go. All these little nuances you've got to remember. Sling plus one. Nice. That'll suit you then, wouldn't it? Yep. Because that's one of your weapons, isn't it? Yeah. Sling, isn't it? Did you just give me the old sling back? Yeah. I worked. <laughs> Potion, identifier. Mummy's tea. Priest of Horus Re in Farm Ooh. of Mulhorend were the first to create the life saving potion. A foul smelling brew made by boiling used mummy wrappings along with naturally desiccated animal remains. It cures. Oh, okay, it cures 
blindness, deafness, and disease. That's going to help us in the valley. Sure, it doesn't call it. Calls it. <laughs> That's amazing. We're going to need these in that cave, I reckon. Where all the things are cures, blindness, deafness, and disease, galls, and all that stuff. They call they make disease, didn't they, and stuff. Necrotic, yeah. What's this one? So we got some stuff to sell now. Uh, put my armor back on. Let me quickly remove my spells. And I'm going to add magic missile. Now should I have shield or reflect image? Uh, I thought reflect image would be quite good, but. Um, Not entirely. What does a shield give me? Five rounds it lasts. Armor class four. My armor class is minus one now, but without the armor, would. Mm. I'll just do reflective image again for now. Just gonna double check what my armor is without that. Six. So we'd knock it down two more. Oh, my armor class has gone zero. It used to be minus one. What have I done there? I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Oh, oh, no, it's minus one there. That's weird. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Right. So we've got to rest again, bud. So I get all the spills back. Sure. Cheers, bud. Free room. Nice. That's coming handy, isn't it? Whilst we're here, something we've got to do. Mm. Do you want to do a quick save? Yeah. Um, so we're going to go back to the smithy, see if we can get stocked up a little bit. Okay. <laughs> we, we still haven't gone back to the other map, the last one we just came from. There's a goblin camp we've got to wipe out as well. That'll get us some good points. Might be worth doing that before we do the Van of Shadows just so we get the extra experience. Yeah, if it's going to be like. More mean uh, enemies. Yeah, it is. Right, so Mummy's Tea. I'll give that back to you after Potion's Keep. We'll need that. We can't sell those two things here. Uh, right. Ooh, ammo belt. You can store all your bullets and stuff inside the ammo belt and only take up one slot. Mm, it makes more sense for you to use it for you arrows. Yeah, so all those arrows I've got stored, I can just chuck them all in that and have one slot of them. That's 300. What else have we got here? Ooh, pig's eye, plus two. 33,000. 55,000. Look at these weapons. The black bow, plus three. 47,000. Oh, mate, look at these. Plus fours. Oh, mate, they've got some weapons here, ain't they? Look. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if, uh, you know, like. Carson Charm or something would lower it. And... Yeah, if you had um, like charisma and could, and maybe that one of them spells, yeah, could mm. lower the prices. Maybe I know this guy's boy is missing. Maybe if we do a mission, I can't remember now. With his boy, yeah. that might bring the money down. Well, yeah, because we can't afford any of these apart from a short sword plus one. But none of us use it. Got some good weapons here, don't they? Plate mail plus one, faith killer plus two axe. Oh, look at that sling. Giant killer plus one, plus four versus giants. 
Oh man, yeah. So I've got this water pelt thing, but I don't know where to set it now. Should I, I set mean, it now? They're quite heavy as well. Yeah, like can always get more. Get more. Let's do that. Okay. So st stabby happy. Stabby stabby. Let's give you that. Um, I've got that gym bag so I can chuckle them in there for now. If we need to sell them later. Um, I didn't buy the ammo belt. Should I get that, do you think? I think it's worth it. Do you think? Yeah. 1700 puts us down to 1400. Hundland the Barbarian. <laughs> Did you want a gem bag? We've got one already. Yes, yeah, not really needed. Okay. So now, yeah, all the axes go in there. All the. Okay, so the ammunition. Right? Hmm. Arrow starts. Uh, bullets. Oh. <sighs> yeah. So that all the arrows are just stored in there like that. Three hundred and twenty. There's one slot. That's a handy. Slot i well, try and use up them throwing axes at some point as well, rather than sell them. <laughs> Range weapon, I might try and use them at some point. Um, <laughs> Eat hacks! <laughs> <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, wait, up here, in there. There's a potion guy up here as well. Oh, my bot just said to that other bot, please refrain from sending long messages. There's <laughs> a bot telling another bot off. Oh, what's that? Okay, what, 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 what me sending a message then? Oh, it's Temple. The temple underneath us. Ah. That's quite handy as well then. There's a temple there. We might need that. That's a boat. This is Oswald Fiddlebender. That's what that girl called you, remember? Ah, yeah. He's a gnome. You speak to him because he's a gnome. You might get a better thing. He's, he's a no. He's a gnome hostile elf. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hello there. I didn't see you come in. What can I do for you? Uh, who are you? Oh, of course, introductions. How rude of me. Sometimes it gets so rough tight in my work. My name is Oswald. Oswald Fiddlebender. Ah. <laughs> Where is this place? Why, this ship is my home. At least it's been since I crashed here over a year ago. I know, I know. There's not much to look at. But someday I'll have a back in one piece and in the air once more. Ah, in the air. You mean this contraption can actually fly? Of course it can. At least it at once. You should have seen it. It was amazing. It was like sailing on the sea of clouds. She's my greatest invention yet, you know. Ah, a flying boat, eh? That is truly amazing. <laughs> I'm glad you think so. I call it an airship. Isn't this wonderful? Airship. As in the ship that floats upon the air. <laughs> and it? It's quite clever once you think about it. Yes. yes. Clever. Clever. Why would you build a, such a strange device? <laughs> the path is through the spine of the world are fraught with many dangers, and the caravans that travel between the Southlands and the Ten Towns must brave not only treacherous terrain, but all the nasty creatures that inhabit it as well. I simply thought to have an alternative route through the mountains, or in this case, over them. Ah. 
So, Aaron, uh, how did you end up in Kent? Oh, no, you already said crash. Interesting. Well, let's take my leave. Farewell. Is there anything I can steal? <laughs> I, think no. he's in, I think you can buy stuff from me, can't you? I don't know. Can you? Potions. Ah. Um. That's, that's racist. Why didn't he offer to his own kind? <laughs> Show us what you got. There we go. What you got for me, bruv? Flaming... Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a fireball potion. Ah. Yeah, when it breaks, spreads flaming oil over everything with a 5 foot radius. 2d8 points of fire damage. Uh, oh, no, 360. Yeah. Potion of mirrored eyes. Is that when you, like, you cross-eyed? <laughs> Immunity to petrification? Oh, okay, yeah, the juicer sort of thing. Pe petrification? Yeah, so that name reduces your turn to stone, so if your eyes are mirrored, you don't see them, you're reflecting back to them. Oh, it's because you're cross Mm hmm. Or the speed? I'm trying to think of any of these would benefit us. Speed? Potion of. Potion of well, that's 900. They're too expensive, aren't they? A lot of money in it. We should Open. just pay them and take them all. <laughs> Anything we really need would be healings or a like poison antidote, maybe, might be handy. Eh. I'm starting to It'd waste. Be an antidote, but. I mean. Yeah. We'll leave him for now. We'll... It's all so expensive. Pardon you. <laughs> oh, nowhere to go here. It's dead end. Cow. <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> Are you sure? I thought it said cluck. <laughs> Alright, there you are. Right, so we have now spoke to everyone. Oh, well, Smithy is him. I think we can do I him can't in a moment. Get there. You are in a place I cannot get to. You need to go back in and back out the other side again. He said. I think that's all the places so, we've Jay, been here. I mean, uh, it's just oh, what's this person here? Brother Ferg, greetings, very traveller. Are you in need of aids? No aids, thank you. I'm a stranger to this town. Perhaps you could tell me the services of my friend here. <laughs> Otherwise, tell us where we can get stuff from, I think. So, Evie, our healer. Said the pooch. Blessings of the broken god. The noises. No, it's the wind blowing through oh. the... Um, it must be... Back doors open and it's causing like, a tunnel effect. Um, that's just asking where things are. Brother Gus... Sister Kadiana. Oh. It really sounds like your, your dog's playing on the, on the hard floor. Now you run downstairs when that wind blew, you got scared. Ah, uh, <laughs> why is this loud? Greeting friend, you are welcome in the house. The bleeding rose, made the healing hands of Limita. Oh. Limita, lift your burdens and set your tortured soul at ease. Could you provide the service of a healer? Being informed correctly, is Hatton head of the temple with my privilege to bestow whatever aid I can upon in need. No small task, I might add, what with all the troubles this plague at this town of late. Hatton, oh. who's normally in charge? Until a few years ago, Reverend Mother Eugenia presided over this house. Alas, she, like so many others in town, have gone missing. Another one gone missing. Presumed dead. 
being the next highest ranking member of the clergy, I assumed the duties of the head of the temple until either she or Reverend Brother Pocalin returns. Your head priest was abducted? Perhaps. We're not quite sure. She grew tired of standing by while the people around us were being snatched up in the night, so she decided to hold a midnight vigil on the outskirts of town in hope that she too might share the suffering of those taken. That was the last we saw of her. Her fate remains a mystery. And you mentioned Reverend Pocalin. Yeah, for what you wish for. Yeah. He's a visiting senior priest of Lamata. He passed through Kaldaha several days ago on the pilgrimage to the Monastery of the Weeping Lilac in Bryn Shanda. He travelled quite ways all the way from from Komia. I believe is what he said. He must be from those distant regions, for he bore a holy symbol of Lamata that was unfamiliar to me. In any case, he promised to return with aid once he reached Bryn Shanda. I hope he's alright. Um, I think that's it. Yeah. Interesting. Uh, well, goodbye. There's nothing he's got to say, is there? Brother Gus? Something's gone wrong here, mate. I think I've been kicked off. Oh, no. What's the time? How long has it been going? Two hours 56. Do you want to save this up then? Yeah, let's save it there. Save. Okay. No. I just want to make sure that we have a hard save. Cool. Sweet. All saved. Yeah. Lovely jubbly. And that is food. a wrap of this chapter. After this one, we'll probably be going off to Goblin Cave. We'll pass back through here. And one second. Ah! Yeah, we'll come back to that bit once we do the Goblin Cave. Go, go in the cave that likes to eat. This is a <laughs> Goblin Cave. Goblin, Goblin. Mm. I wonder if there's turkeys in there. I wonder when you get to the mouth of the cave, you, all you can hear is... <laughs> I bet Girth would be standing there. They're scary creatures, man. They're scary creatures. Yeah, they're not on the prettiest of this solid of animals. Tasty, though. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, I, I think... Three. Yeah, we'll do. Play some more before you, you go off to your new castle.